and uh, everyone went crazy. They went completely nuts and mm -hmm. absolutely nuts. And I thought, hmm, I'll play again. I played it twice. And then I played it three times. And, that, and they went mad every time. So I thought, I think this one could do well. <laughs> and when I finally got signed, it was released. And it rocketed into the charts at number 106, I believe. <laughs> Uh, you know, not looking great, it was not looking great. It gradually crept up the charts like a few places every week, you know, and then the one on tour with China Crisis, and then, then people started to hear it a bit more, got a bit of radio play, and it, it crept up to number 44. And you know, top of the pops were looking at it, but you know, 44 was not really top of the pops, it's it? like <laughs> bottom of the pops. <laughs> <laughs> but you know, it was very lucky because uh, there was a very there was a shortage of eighties pop stars that uh, that week. <laughs> there was a dearth, and you know, Joanne Joanne were in the, in the. I think they were in the. Uh, well, there's people screaming at them wherever they were. Up <laughs> so they were. They were in the Caribbean filming the video, probably, and uh, George Michael was in New York uh, recording something. So they had to go down the chart a bit further than you. <laughs> oh, what's this here? 44. Oh, yeah, new song. So we got our break that day. And everything changed then, you know, forever. It's great. <laughs> Don't crack up, bend your brain, see both sides, throw off your mental chains. <laughs> that's, that's, it's still a bit by that. And this is my little, slightly different version of it at the front. Just to throw you up. It's like a Glen Campbell version of them. <laughs> I love Glen Campbell, I really do. The Wichita Lion one, the reason why. No, Wichita Lion I don't want to be